There we go. Good evening, folks. I'm going for an unusually solo stream um, for the achievement, A Tale of Two Families. Achievement text, starting as Vijayanagar or Bachmanis, conquer the other capital and have them not exist. So you're either Bachmanis and Vijay doesn't exist, or you're Vijay and Bachmanis doesn't exist. To have uh, the other's capital. Forming any of the formable nations like Bharat or Hindustan will prevent the achievement. What could be simpler? I noticed this uh, achievement was available during the uh, ongoing co-op campaign. This music is really too loud. I cannot hear myself think uh, none of these things are music options. So good luck to me. Europa, quiet. Yes, the co-op campaign in India's uh, Kuamon slash Gwalior. Um, Bahamani's and Vijay are starting to get involved. So, what are the differences we've got here? We've got a kingdom and a sultanate. We've got a f well above average ruler and a uh, slightly above average ruler. These ideas are kind of trady, combat -y. Bahamani's are Long, long flavor text for extra manpower recovery speed, um, dip rep, and so forth. The J has, uh, sorry, Bagmanis have the have a vassal, Telangana, and um, Vijay has a has a vassal in the Jaffna. Oh yes, of course, down in the south. Almost forgot about that. Salon used to I'm sure exist as a nation, but never mind. So we need to conquer one as the other. They're both. Uh, there's not a lot between them. Vijay has the edge in, probably in terms of in terms of development, um, and certainly a number of provinces has the edge in terms of Vijay's got the easier option of just slaughtering everyone around them whereas the oh, web of alliances are tangled here gonna work fairly fairly well backed up so we'll go with the um, first start of Batman Partly because they are um, Shia and I haven't played. Is the Iron Man check? No two families. Start off. Any Sultanate in fourteen forty four. Yeah, it looks all right. So we have a little bit of flavor text here. Done. Shia gives us extra morale, which is 
delicious. Extra chance of New Year, which is nice enough, but since there's no personal unions, it doesn't make a huge amount of difference. Gives extra shock damage. That's quite nice at the... Uh, A consort. Last time I played single player, I can't remember what it was. Button, which is greyed out, which doesn't. That's great. Excellent starting ruler with well connected and fierce negotiator, which means we can hire cheaper. fact, our ruler is younger than his heir. But if you played session, then it is an interesting one. So the veggies already rivaled us and we're going to be demolishing them. Let's rival them right back. Girat, Malwa and Orissa reckon they want to rumble with us. I'm going to hang fire on selecting our next rivals in case there are any... Uh, is actually pretty damn good at starting gates. I mean, for a country this size. Does mean we can hire. First limit, meh, fort fence. That could be useful if we need to get an alliance. Uh, stability cost and yearly prestige. Yeah, they're all right. Our religious unity is... Awful. A lot of unrest, and it's going to take us quite a while to convert. Surplus. Change. Right, so tax policy. I really don't know a lot about this. Full of she well, I've never, never played Shia in my life. Our liberty desire in our only vassal is not huge. So Word. Why do we start out with what? Special about you, Golconda. Now, Rissa is another one to watch out for because they have four vassals out of the gate. Um, so Let's get current. Figure out what the situation is. Who likes us and who doesn't. Okay. So Gujarat already hate us. Mala already hate us. Orissa are none too fond of us either. Jampur, again, don't really like. Options down here would be... Very small miners, but that would have the advantage of actually being close to, to Vijay to be able to pack a punch. Maybe Andhra, who are already friendly, might even go so far as to being diplovasalized, but unlikely due to... So it looks like our options for allies out of the starting gate. Big beefy alliances. Pure and Bengal might take a bit of convincing.
Dahl are probably a better option. Now, is there a... Okay. All right, then let's start ourselves improving relations with a few people. A short campaign, I hope. Six was there at least a four war job, assuming they get no more land, which they will. versus heretics is probably not that useful since all of our heathen or all of our non um, downside to taking that really all right i've done no prep work for this so let's just wind things on and see but we should also select our rivals Probably based on who we're going to ham into. Right. Yeah. Starting generals, we do not. Okay. Well, as what we're doing, we should start. Somehow, Yeah, uh, I'll take it anyway. Sure, uh, we have our diplomats doing stuff. Let's collect from trade here. Forwarding, I hope. So we start off with cores on Vigil. Right, who are you allied with? Okay, well, that could be useful. That could be useful. Probably sp
Okay. I cannot spell anything. Jun, that'd be why. Uh, so we're looking at, what, 6,000. But yeah, so they're, they probably have the numbers on us, but we would probably have, probably have the, um, The early, early move might be to jump on Gujarat as a way of... Give Mawar some of the land in the north that they... Um, jump here somehow decides they want to tambor but chances you take Or would join in for land. Which obviously would. General through estate interactions. Oh, hello, Marathas. Nice to meet you. Amirs. Brabans, I know. Janes, I know. Ulema. Vaguely, I don't know, Finnish? Estonian? Right. Grant generalship. I can indeed. Wrath has to lose loyalty. Apart from them. I am terrible, I have to say, at uh, So it looks like the Amirs and the Marathas are uh, set up against each other, annoyingly. That's not as nice. See what we can do. Very poor supply limit. Trish and hell. Pro 
probably should have gone for Kandesh first of all. Uh, so let's do that. Well, tire a merc or two. Slightly catch him. Hey, okay. okay. Gifting our enemies. Let's go for it. Our true capital. Extra defensiveness, yes, please. Watered by that bit that slipped past. Wow, okay. But Baglana, let's let in a dar. And let's also There is some, there is some, um, logic, actually, for me to have not done this and to have just gone straight for Vijay. It's going to be a short campaign. General at the moment, so let's go.
Baruch. Some of you, hopefully. Some of you, actually. You two get out. In fact, the main lot of you get out. Can I catch some? That meh. Into one. Do anything else? Ah, hello, Segalzeron. Who do you play? Oh, I can't go to you because you're not. Oh, that's not. Why? How is that not? I did anyway. Save them. Can't. Ah, they were only marks, so though. They deserved to die. It's like... Let's actually get you guys under siege here. And let's uh, raise another merc. Beat him up and steal their lunch money. You make a good point. How much of their lunch money can I take? A fair amount. That's fair to say. Um, did I plan on taking... Plan on taking... A plan for this other than... Solidifying my control of the coast here. Now, you have claims, which are useful. I could vassalize you. Feed you. It's just a distraction from beating up. I'm doing an achievement run, as the uh, title suggests. Not a difficult achievement, has to be said, but uh, an achievement. Ship. No, which where do I have it? And power either, which is the worrying thing. Well, the numbers are are very much in our favour here. Can be no escape from the mighty elephant. Building a ship for some reason. Finished. Spooking around up there. 
the achievement uh, is a good question a tale of two families um requires you to start as either back manis which i started as or vijay and kill the other basically oh attrition uh yeah you need to own their land and their capital all oh, right yeah of course i don't start with any boats because i don't have any coast yeah that would be so um i'm doing a co-op campaign in the north of uh, india at the moment one with uh, my ally or we've taken over roughly this amount of india except for john pure they've been our staunch ally. i thought i'd see if there's any other achievements to be had other than Raj of the Rajput Reich, because yeah, that is not a short campaign. But this, this I figured could be done reasonably quickly. Yeah. Murderized. That's what I love about the early battles, is they are very swingy. Start off both with similar morales, and somebody just gets utterly destroyed. But yeah, legalism and mysticism remind me of this. Uh, so getting mystic gives you extra morale. And extra missionary strength, but legalism gives you, excuse me, tick cost and tax and those are both very good things uh, since we're at negative piety we might as well towards mysticism we're gonna be fighting lots morale is good money is also good because it helps you fight more but that early game morale here let's go and stand on out until those locked in oh yeah wow maybe they couldn't hold out man altered field trips as well it's come easy go Because I have it in my head that this is a, a quote-unquote easy campaign, I'm playing a little bit sloppy here, but... Rip my men. Salmer is going for Sind as well. They smell the blood. take a lot because I already have it. Now if I were to give you some of Sin Moir, would you be happy? Care. Care no matter how much I gave you. Well then I see no reason to do that. Really. siege that or is in it for the for the laugh basically yes <laughs> they're in it just because we're beating up their rival Do nicely. Oh. Reason not to, other than the horrible aggressive expansion it would cause. Okay. 
guy Telangana sieging up Thatta. Esh coming back down here and potentially de -sieging. Looting, looting quite nicely. Who are you again? Yeah, I almost, well, I don't almost never play in India. I'm currently playing a campaign in India while I'm playing another campaign in India. That being said, I'm not that familiar with a lot of the miners. Usually, but it's, oh, right. Are you at war with them? Usually by the time you, uh, you're you a European and you get round here, uh, India at most. Fish. Alwa, you hate me, so let's get fabricating on you as well. All this is just distraction from the main main game of Vijay, Andra, and Calicut. I reckon I could take them. Ah, a mere bagatelle. All there is to it, I kind of want this guy to fall so that I can separate piece them out. So oh, Sigals are on. Who do you play as in Europa? Do you play Europa? It's bold of me to assume that you do. Sin, 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 sin. I could give. Take your money. Take your war reps. Something to Mawar, so they. Waste just to do that, but. You, I would never be able to stop you rebelling away from me, so. Didn't really care for me doing that. So, which is a very bad thing to do in real life, but. Salmer and Kutch. If that means I can, uh, they're never gonna. They're never gonna pull the trigger. It's trust and favors by default. 
Right, rotten poor. Tell me about yourself. You are allied with someone of whom I... Square root of no one. I don't even control the siege anyway, do I? Here, and how many do I need to leave? Erics. Of course it's not. Leave you. Do we have enough then? We do. Delicious. Yeah, we're not quite as positive in the treasury, but we're still pretty positive, so let's get more mercs. Sind as well. Wrecked, so everybody wants to destroy Sind. through the estate and throw him at these and it moves us more towards legalism well what could be better now since we have a diplomat let's get Aggressive expansion. Oh, right, yeah, because I haven't actually taken anything yet. Oh, Gujarat. Oh, that's peace. Never mind. Never mind. Oh, you're... More mercs. to take up the slack. Eric was probably not needed, but... 45 minutes already, I've made no progress. Speed 3. Speedrunner, I think. Just uh... all right. Oh, you wouldn't take a lot. Oh, right. I'm in a war. Which telling me. We said, well, that's right, I was going to vassalize you, wasn't I? You'll hate me. Really, really hate me. I vassalize you, that'll draw me to war with. Seems like an idea. 
like a real good idea. Can will drag me to war with anyone. Ends of war, I'm sure it will. Leave them any money. Well, Ugh. I don't really need their money. So we're... I am very careful about checking who I'm... Uh, I try to be very careful about checking who I'm negotiating with because the number of times I've gone, hey, yeah, let's just uh, peace out this miner for not very much. Oh, wait, that was the war leader. The carefully crafted war that I've been fighting for 20 years is now over for a white piece with one of the miners. Okay. Also, is it just me or is my stream really glitching out here? Yeah, so we assume leadership. I'm sure the war screen used to say, and this will drag us to war with. You have a quite good gen. Just uh, melt it quite quick. Hum, hum, a little bit more hum. Ah, let's do it anyway. Take him. <laughs> Star General at this stage, huh? Fortunately. taking that money actually down a bit actual war not just one where we walk in and uh Uh, and now I have a hundred percent with Gujarat, which I, so I could take. I could take all of them. That being said, humiliating is always a good idea. Yep. Do land, okay. Really want to do is unlock the transfer subject interaction. But I need to get more uh, splendor for that. I take these three, that gives me a bit of coastline. Cover Konkan ports, right, well. None of those, right enough. Huh. 
quite interesting. Very, very... Six. Oh, and your lunch money, of course. How could I forget your lunch money? All your lunch money, then. Some of these mercs. Got a lot of aggressive expansion. Nice bumped prestige. Leaves them to be torn apart by the miners in the area. Yeah, that seems like an idea. That will be humiliated. It's the growing. Uh, always a bit more than I would want to bite off at the moment. Oh, I needed to sneeze there, but couldn't. Straighten. Right, Battle of the Generals here. over just in case. Okay, what was I even worried about? I want a royal marriage. Reason? Just punch my microphone for good measure. Punched up. And Gujarat's no longer valid. Guns. And uh, back and make money. Fabricating on you. Uh, both terrible lands. Both. Age countries on the go now. Army. Is looking really healthy. The J looking less healthy. No, that's me. <laughs> Going, he's got no manpower. He's got less of an army than. Oh, right, wait. Wrong way around. <laughs> Possibly turned the game down a little bit too much. So let's turn that back. So what I've got set up is um, the game audio should be ducked when I talk. It might be terribly distracting, or it might not be. We shall see. Excellent. Got the breach. You hate me. Let's forever friends. Friends? Let's be friends. Dar going for Gujarat. Yep. <laughs> like I said, the miners smell weakness. It's just a Dar. Get the professionalism up even more. Loyal estates. Yeah, that is bad actually. Let's, let's get back. Bacantha as well. Boy. Let's promote you as well. Oh no, that would hurt that. Oh, jeez. 
It ain't easy being cheesy. Oh, you have won. You are a winner. And tell me what your course. Well, well. Would give me give me my final Everyone is going for Kajuras. Oh, I feel sorry for them now. I'll leave you with money so you can rebuild your army. Yeah. Good. Yeah, I kind of thought that might be the case. Oh, and you just declared war. Oh. I really hope it's just you. It's just you. Oh, and you even have claims. You even have claims, you son of a gun. Uh, I do not deserve that luck. A three-star general over there, and... Uh, elephants as well. Finest elephants. Don't think. Arms, because it's a defensive call to arms. Ah, oh, that's lovely. That is. But I won't. Actually, it's in my interest if they do smack them. Then I can. Please, that to Russian territory. Ah, well, what are they going to do? Horrible things, no doubt. Elephants. Why wouldn't you do that? Oh well. Kill you just as easily as I can kill anyone else. Uh, okay, fighting them would be defending their land. Even better. I can occupy this and then go and smack them once they've occupied it. Stack those uh, positive modifiers. Uh, improve relations. 